is Just Can't Stop, and welcome to a brand new series I am starting. I am going to call this Can't Stop Crafting. Um, I have thrown together my own mod pack where it has some of my favorites, some of um, some mods that I've never even used before where they just sounded really interesting, um, and some of the basics. Um, but yeah. Uh, I can't wait to get started. So I have um, some plans here. So first of all, which you'll probably notice, if not right away, um, these leaves here, um, they represent biomes of plenty. So that is most definitely in this mod pack. Um, also, there's a snake right there, so you probably already know that we have mo creatures, mo creatures installed in here. Oh, there it is. Um, I did start myself off with um, the starter chest just because sometimes it makes it really easy. Um, I also spawned in a really cool location. Like I'm already in a cave area. I have plains up there. Um, there's tons of animals around. However, I don't see a sheep anywhere. Lots of cows. Let's see what we got in our starter chest. We got a stone axe, which is really good. Um, we got some apples, also really good. So, before we do anything, um, I also have, and I honestly don't know why. This is, oh, yay! This is taking inventory. Yay! Um, so, I have this crystal ball here from Minecraft Comes Alive. So, we are just going to um, right click that. And it's going to send us to a place. Um, it says, ooh, ooh, we got we got the shakes. Right click the enchantment table to begin. Oh, before I get motion sickness, are you a male or a female? I'm most definitely a female. And I prefer males. My name is Just Can't Stop. That is correct. Now, um, if I choose a few of these, it's going to send me to different locations. And I don't want to get sent to a different location. I want to happen upon a village and possibly uh, meet my future baby daddy. Um, but as of right now, I'm going to say none of these, so it'll bring me right back to where I started. Um, so that way I'm not cheating and I almost got sick. That room was nuts, so. Okay, so, did I get everything? Okay, I grabbed everything out of there. Let's, um, let's cut this down because I'm going to take it with me. We're also going to uh, take these guys. Um, I should probably, I think I have enough stuff that I can make a real quick... Yeah. Let's make a real quick crafting table. I do not have enough wood for a pickaxe. So let's um, basically just do that. Now we will have enough wood for a pickaxe. I can grab some of this coal and some of this other stuff. So that we don't even have to start off with the basic... Um, wooden tools. I mean besides this pickaxe, obviously. So let's let's get some stone first all. First of all, let's get that stone. And then we can do some exploring, figure out where we want to live. Um I hate to be that person that sets up really close to spawn, but I have a feeling this is going to be like look at that mini map. Look at how beautiful the land is. Um obviously I don't know for sure because I haven't been up there. Um but we're, we're definitely going to do a lot of exploring in here. We do have biomes of plenty in here. We also have quite a few um, other mods that kind of alter the terrain and what kind of materials we have. Um, like there's an ancient tree mod, which the ancient trees don't actually grow. Um, we have to find the saplings, and to find those, we can either get them um, through loot bags, which I have um, on the mob, so we can get them in loot bags, or in dungeons, all kinds of stuff like that. I also have a dungeons mod on, so that more dungeons will be spawning. Also, there's a ruins mod, I believe. Um, the mod list and everything that we have going on here will be below. Can I break that? No, I can't. Um, will be below. Um, so that if you guys are interested in playing this, um, you can download the same mods and do it the way I'm doing it. I actually, um, I'm using Curse Voice where I actually got, that guy's wearing a really cool hat. Come back here, cow. 
I want your hat. Come back in. Stop running away from me. Stop running away from me. I want your hat. Come back. Thank you. And I will take your leather too, because we need that. Um. Yep. <laughs> We now have a really cool hat on our heads. Uh, if everyone's not afraid of us now, I don't know what else to do. Um, but like I was saying, um, I'm using Kerr's voice, and what you can do is create your own profile. By doing that, you can create your own mod packs, which is what I did here. Um, I love Kerr's voice. I use it for um, all the other mod packs I play. Um, Project Ozone was done through Kerr's voice. Um, it honestly just makes everything really simple. You don't have to go look up all the mods. You don't have to go download them all. It does it for you. Um, and then as you go, you can either choose to keep the mods, um, turn them off, disable them, or completely remove them from the mod pack altogether, depending on um, if you like them or not. So that's always good. Let's make a sword. It's always good to have a sword. There we go. Now let's get some of this, let's get some more stone, because we're going to need a lot of stone. I really need to make a backpack. I do have multiple backpack mods in here. I have one that's going to be more helpful than anything, but then I have another one that is just really cool. Um, they're adventure backpacks, so they look a little different, and you can collect, I think there's like 20 to 30 different ones. Hold on, I'll show you real quick. Let's just type in backpack. So these ones right here, the adventure backpack. So there's a standard one, and then there's all of these, all different ones. And some of them have um, certain, uh, what do you call, uh, certain things that they do. Like the chicken backpack, you lay eggs if you're wearing it. Like it, it's, it's really cool, actually. I can make a sleeping bag. I need carpet. Okay. Um, that's the other thing about these backpacks. They actually come with, or at least this one does. Yeah, they come with a sleeping bag. So you make the basic adventure backpack, and then you can actually set this thing on the floor, and you can make a um, a little uh, what's it called? <laughs> I can't think. A little um. A sleeping bag will come out, and you can you can sleep in the sleeping bag. So it's really good if you're um, running around looking for a place to live, or just running around checking out new biomes, and you need to sleep real quick before something kills you. Um, so I thought that was really cool. I obviously had to add it in immediately. What is this tin ore? I don't know if I'm gonna need it, but we're gonna definitely collect it anyways. No, oh, there's quite a bit of it over here. Okay, I think that was it. Now I need to get out of the hole. Let's get some more of this coal. We're going to go around this corner real quick and check out what's going on um, with the lava over there, if there's anything good around it. And then we're probably just going to head out and see what we can see, what kind of cool animals we can find. So in this series, I have quite a few plans. There are things that I want to do. But if there's things that you guys want to see me do, um, looking at the mod pack, I know there's going to be a ton of things that I don't even know about because there's mods in here that I just saw real quick and I was like, oh, that looks cool. So if there are things that you want me to try out, you want me to to do, please leave that in the comments and I will try to get to it because um, honestly I have no idea what I want to do. I just, there's a few things that I do want to do and the rest I'm like, oh, um, I don't know. There's, like, so much stuff over here. Here's some copper. Whatever that sparkly stuff was I couldn't get. Please don't have lava. Okay. We're good. We're good. No lava. It's already starting to get dark. Should I just set up camp here? I mean, I don't have really anything to set up camp with. Oh, my God. There's a spawner. Are you kidding me? Let's make some torches really quick. Oh, my god, what are the chances? It's a spider spawner, too. So, can I place a torch on this before the spider gets me? Yes, I can. Now let's get the spider. Come on! Oh, he just really doesn't exist, I guess. 
the nice thing is we're still really close to spawn. Look at all of this stuff. Why can't I take this? Now I can. I'll take all that stuff for sure. Oh my. <gasps> we got our first backpack. It's the bat backpack. That's really cool. These don't stack, apparently. I tried to stack it and it didn't work. These don't stack either. No. I don't I don't know what happened. Well, I don't really need that music disc. We definitely are going to take one of these chests. Should I take both? Yeah, let's just take them both. Take both of those chests. You just chill there, spawner. Let's kill this guy before he tries to kill me. Where'd he go? I guess we don't have to worry about it. He left. Okay, so let's um, go back to where I feel like it's semi-safe. What's in here? Nothing. I mean, nowhere is really semi-safe, honestly. They can drop in on us at any time. So maybe I will block off an area. Ooh, that's definitely not safe. Totally not safe. Nope, nope, you stay over there. Run, just run, 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 run. All I have is this stupid stone sword. What are you? You're not normal. Yeah, yeah. Don't blow that up. Don't blow that up. Oh, you douche. How rude. 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 Oh, it's still there. Okay, good. But I don't have any inventory to pick it up. So let's show off this backpack <laughs> now that we have no inventory. So if you place it down on the ground like that, you can open it up. And there's this little, I don't know if you can see the outline. I know you can't see my mouse, but the outline's flashing of a little um, sleeping bag. So we can, let's actually throw a lot of this stuff in here. I don't know why these are being ridiculous, but they are. Um, let's throw a bunch of this stuff in here. Because we don't need this right now. Um, ooh, I'll take that bread though, because I'm sure I'm going to get hungry very shortly. Let's get rid of that wooden pickaxe. Why I have to... I think I got one out of the thing. So, let's get rid of that wooden axe. Get rid of the chests. We have all these torches. Okay, so now there's a bunch of stuff in there, which is really nice. Let's throw up some torches in here so I don't have... Bad guys spawning literally right next to where I'm trying to sleep. Um, I tried to dig a moat. I don't know if you guys could tell what I was trying to do there. I was trying to dig a moat so they couldn't get to me, but it didn't really work. They were far too close. Um, so there's that. Let's take a little nap. Let's sleep in our sleeping bag. That's so exciting that on our very first day we found one of these. See, it opens up this little sleeping bag and then you can sleep in it like it's just like a bed. So it's really neat for traveling and it just makes life so much easier. Did it please turn to daytime? Yes, it did. Okay, good. So then all you have to do is hit it. Um, same thing with this guy. You just kind of hit it and it'll come off the ground. So, my plan was to try to collect all of, ooh, something, a cow died. I'll take your stuff. Um, my plan was to try to collect all of the backpacks, and we already have a head start. So what is this? I don't, Prometheum more? Can I collect you? I certainly can. So yeah, that's really cool. The bat one, and the bat one you can only find in caves. I don't believe you can actually make it. Yeah, you can't make it. You have to find it in dungeons and mine shafts and that kind of stuff. Um, so what was the percentage? Let's see where it is. 2.5% and somehow we got it on the first day. So that's, that's really cool. <laughs> so yeah, there's some that you can't even make, like that one. What is this? A lapis backpack. But as you can see... Some of them have actual, um, 
recipes that you can make them, you have to make this adventure backpack first every single time, which is fine. Um, so what is this one? The iron golem one. You can't get it anywhere besides a blacksmith. Which is pretty cool, not gonna lie. Um, why are they all changing? That's weird. Uh, but yeah, like, I think there's another one. Which one is it? I think it's the villager one that you really can't get it anywhere. You can't, it doesn't even tell you how to get it. I think you have to trade with a villager to get it. Um, cause you can't make it, and I don't think you can find it in a chest, I, I think only villagers carry it, so in order to get it, you have to trade emeralds with a villager to get it. Um, but yeah, there's that. What is this? Sir, sir, I just, no, no, oh. Seriously? Is there anything good down here? Is that why they keep coming from down here? I'm sorry if you guys can't see. I'm just checking it out really quickly. Yeah, there's nothing here. Let's put a torch at the very end. Um, we're going to pack up our stuff and go. We're going to try to find a place to live now that we haven't literally left this area since we spawned it. <laughs> so let's, um, do I have everything? I have my backpack. Most everything's in there. We're good to go. Let's go for a little a waxy poo. What's up here? Oh, these boars are mean. They attack you. We have so many animals. Look at them all. It's like the animal kingdom out here. This boar is going to attack me any minute now. I can feel it. So we have like a... <gasps> I have to go get that tree. I have to go get that tree. Leave me alone, boar. Try to get this tree. It's pink. Pretty. Um, so yeah, there's a bunch of different trees. Like I was saying earlier, this is one of my favorites. Um, I have not seen them all. Um, so I don't know what other kinds of trees there actually are. But this one right here, it's a Japanese... Oh, it's a Sakura log. It's a... Um, I want to say it was a Japanese like cherry tree or something like that, but I'm probably 100% wrong. And by cutting down this tree, I can also show you another mod that I have installed. And five, four, three, timber. I have the tree uh, capitator. I think that's how you say it, the tree capitator. So all you have to do is cut down one log of the tree, and everything above it will fall, which makes building and gathering materials so much easier. Let's get to the top of this and see what we can see. Um, ooh, ooh, we got we got a little lag, just a little, just a little lag there. Um, but also while we're up here, I can show you we have these geishal greens, and the only reason why we would have geishal greens is if we had choco craft, which we do. Um, so yes, there are chocobos in here, and I do plan on collecting some chocobos, maybe breeding them and getting the special ones that you can't get otherwise. The rare ones. Oh, this guy's gonna hurt me. Leave me alone. You're so pretty, why do you have to be so mean? Um, I actually kind of like this area. Oh, we got sheep. Let's grab some sheep so we can get a real bed. Hi, chicken! I kind of need your chicken meat. Thank you. Oh, and I'm going to be really mean real quick, but this is a really pretty bird, and we're going to kill it because... Stop moving. Stop moving. Bird, I want I want you. Okay. Um, what I'm going to do now is show you another mod that we have installed, and this is called the Morphs mod. So now that I've killed a bird, I can turn into said bird which makes me really tiny, but I can fly, which makes searching for a house so much easier. Um, let's kill these sheep. I'm going to continue, I think, exploring on foot for right now, just because I do need to gather materials. Oops. I do need to gather materials and do my thing. If you know what I mean, I'm going to fall. Boop. Um, and food, because, you know, we all need food. Um, snake. 
Are you gonna be mean or are you a nice snake? You're a nice snake. This red one's not so much though. So. Ooh, stay away, stay away. Let's get some more wool here. I'm sorry, sheep, but I need your wool. Are these strawberries? They are. So we can gather some strawberries from these plants. Yeah, yeah. Let's grab some more of this Secura log. Did I get any blossoms? Secura samplings. Samplings. So this will give me some more of those logs, and I'm dying of hunger. I need to eat, but I don't want to stop because I'm almost done with this log. There we go. I love watching them fall. It's so pretty. Such a big impact on the atmosphere. <laughs> Cutting everything down. All of your wildlife here. I'll be nice and I'll replant. Um, did I grab everything? I think I got everything. Let's grab saplings. I got quite a few saplings, so we'll replant a couple of these. There we go. Now I don't feel so bad. What are those trees? Oh, there's one right here. What are you? What are you, tree? A bald cypress. Um, I think it gives me white wood, but actually, the white wood would look really pretty. Am I gonna regret, re regret this? Hey, I need your wool. Thank you. Um, there's a sapling for this tree already, and I didn't cut it down. I probably might crash so I apologize if this is crashes um, I did not mean it to this is also going to take forever we're so close now so close now almost oh please don't crash please don't crash oh my god <laughs> Oh, I didn't even get the whole thing, but it's still totally worth it. That was really neat. Let's uh, go collect what I can. And we got a bunch of saplings, so when we figure out where we want to live, we can just replant if we need more wood. Um, I don't want to leave this tree like the way it is. I feel kind of bad because it's kind of like weird looking now. Um, but I broke my, yeah. Let's place down the crafting table. And let's, I have a couple pieces of stone. Um, let's make a couple sticks. Make some sticks, and we can make an axe. We'll make two axes, because I have a feeling we're going to need them. Um, and let's try to cut down <laughs> some more of this tree that I can't reach. Will this work? Will this work? There we go. Look at all of that. Close enough, because I ain't getting all the way up there. Okay. <laughs> So basically what it does, it'll use, it'll cut down as much as my axe would have been able to handle, which turns out to be quite a bit. Um, I only used two axes, one was already partially used, and I got over a stack with that first axe. Now I have um, one, two, almost three stacks, and I haven't even collected it all, and it's getting dark already! Oh my god! I literally need to focus more. <laughs> <laughs> on finding somewhere to live and not chopping everything down. Oh, someone killed a chicken. How rude. But that's okay, because it's feeding me, so thank you, in retrospect. Um, let's try to gather all of this wood. <laughs> I don't want to let it go to waste. I'm going to need it. Cause I, have, I think I have a plan for a house. I don't know, it could turn out really bad, but... Oh my god, a turtle! Hi, hi turtle. You're not even by water. What are you doing? Oh no, I'm so sorry. I'll fix you. I'm sorry, turtle. I really do apologize. I didn't mean to flip you upside down. Um, let's let's put our backpack down real quick and sleep. I don't see any bad guys yet, which is good news. Oh, there's Enderman over there. 
sleep real quick. Let's get in that bed and sleep. Mm-hmm. All right, you guys. It is morning time, and ooh, that snake's going crazy. Mm. And I'm going to call this an episode. We're still in our hunt to find a nice place to live, but um, we are already collecting materials. We've already gotten our first adventure backpack, the little bat one. How cute it's a little bat. Um, and uh, from here on out, we're just going to find some place to live. Hopefully I will get my life situated <laughs> and I will figure out what I'm really supposed to be doing right now, what my accomplishments are supposed to be rather than collecting a bunch of wood where we don't have anywhere to build with. Um, but the good news is I have the sapling so I can grow more once we find where we're going to live. Um, not that this would be a bad area. It's really not that bad of an area, now that I think of it. Let's turn into a bird real quick and get a bird's eye view of this, this space. Shrinking down, now I'm the size of you. Whoa, no, you're like a giant to me now. What's up? What's up, pal? You want to be friends? You want to be friends? Mm. Bye! Um, so where are we at? Actually, this really isn't a bad area at all. We have the caves and stuff over here. We have some water over here. We have all these ginormous trees, which are really pretty. Um, we have all kinds of animals. We have islands that we can turn into things. Excuse the lag. Um, it's trying to load in more chunks. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes it takes a little time to do that. We have a lava fall. We have a lava pit. We have all kinds of cool stuff over here. I mean, it, it's <laughs> really not that far away from spawn, so if I die in the meantime, I won't be too far away. We have some horses and zebras. We have zebras! We have a lot of these secure trees, which is really cool. But like I said, we are definitely going to do some exploring. So even if we do, I think this is the spot, honestly, you guys. I think I think this is where we need to, to live. Because look how perfect. There's caves everywhere. There's animals everywhere. These, these huge, awesome, beautiful trees everywhere. There's water everywhere. Oh my goodness. Let's go this way. <gasps> and there's a chance cube. Alright, you guys. I'm going to leave it off right here. If you guys like this spot, let me know. I'm going to do some more exploring, and I will make a final decision um, once I look around a little bit. I'll probably just fly like I am right now to find a spot. It also keeps me safe from all the monsters. Look at the chocobos! Look at the chocobos! Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you're looking forward to the series just like I am, please let me know. Um, press that like button. The more likes it gets, the more support I feel and the more excited I'll get over this series because I know that I'm not the only one excited for it. Um, also, I'm going to need names because I plan on having a lot of pets. A lot of pets. So if you guys want to leave names below, that would be really cool. Um, and we could have a little farm, maybe build Noah's Ark, have two of each animal. That would be really cool as well. Um, but we're definitely going to try to collect one of each color chocobo. We're also going to have like our normal farms, like a cow farm, a sheep farm, a pig farm, that kind of stuff. But then there's so many other animals, like turtles. And um, what is this? There's something. I think it's a bear. These little guys. I would love to tame these guys. They're kind of like wolves. I think they attack things for you if you can tame them, but you have to figure out how to tame them first. Um, all kinds of really cool stuff. So I'm, I'm looking forward to exploring, and um, why is there dirt on this tree? Oh, it's not on the tree. It's just in the sky. That's all. Odd. Can we land on it? I would like to land on these random dirt blocks in the sky. Maybe turn back into myself. And say goodbye <laughs> with my really cool hat on that I forgot I had on. Um, so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Like I said, if you liked it, click that like button. Any ideas, any names, any 
um, thoughts on this specific area, please let me know. It's obviously not going to look like this once I'm done with it. I'm going to have to do some terraforming and whatnot to get it to the way I want it. Um, but yeah, if you have any ideas on builds I should build, like, I don't know, some sort of mansion or whatever, um, let me know. I'm not the greatest builder, but I'm certainly going to try, and that's kind of what this series is going to be about, between building really cool things and crafting really cool things and collecting really cool things. It's going to be so much fun. And the animals, of course, can't forget the animals. And we're going to try, so I'll explain it to you in the next episode. Okay, <laughs> this one's going on far too long already. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!